What's good? This is Ashley's Corner. Um, shout out to um, <laughs> shout out to the boxing clinic. First of all, um, this is where I heard this and got the link uh, from um, from him. The boxing voice called up with uh, Robert Garcia and asked him if um, if Danny Garcia, I mean, if uh, Mikey Garcia was moving down to 130 after the fight. And he was like, um, at um, 135 or 130, uh, he, if they don't get Loman Kachiko or uh, Robert Easter, that after the Adrian Broner fight, they're going to move up to 147. Now, everybody on that money run right now, because... That must be the only reason why he's doing this, you know what I'm saying? He's been in the game for a while. I think he like he's uh twenty nine, so, you know, he's like, where's the next, you know, next next step up in competition? I get it, but I thought about who the fuck is you really gonna beat at one forty seven? You know what I'm saying? And if you beat the hell out of Adrian Broner, why in the hell would Robert Easter want to fight you? Honestly, that's like him saying that he's better than Adrian Broner, if, even if, if he take the fight, if he beat the hell out of Adrian Broner. You know? But Loman Kachiko, let's think about that for a second. Loman Kachiko uh, called him out after the fight. He was like, cool, you know what I'm saying? He'll he'll fight uh, Mikey Garcia. Mikey Garcia answered it and said, yeah, so... I don't see why there would be a problem there unless there's, you know, some technical paperwork bullshit that one of them are crying over. So, I mean, I see that as, you know, very, very possible, you know. But after that, who's to say he's still not going to move up to 147 pounds? But when you think about the the people that's at 147, you know, he's moving up for the money, so he's moving up for you know, the top three or four names, you know what I'm saying? They're trying to get a belt in the welterweight division. Then, you know, Earl Spence, I mean, shit. <laughs> Mikey Garcia is 5'6", five, 5'7". Five, I know Box Box Rec had it at 5'6", but I seen um, on Encyclopedia, on the Wikipedia, that um, it, it was at 5'7". But he's 5'6", five, 5'7", he's, five, five, with a, a 68". Um, 68 inch reach. Okay, Spence has a 72 inch reach, and he's five nine and a half. You know, besides the power and the skill that you know both of them have, there's no way in the world Mikey Garcia is beating Earl Spence Jr. So, when you think about Porter, Porter is short as well. He's five seven. You know what I mean? He's um, and he got a, a one and a half inch difference. You know, and and reach to his favor, but that's about it. You know, but still, I think Sean Porter <laughs> will fuck Mikey Garcia up. Honestly, I think he'll rough him up to the point, and you know, probably, you know, stop Mikey Garcia seriously. But then you talk about one time, okay? Keith Thurman. <laughs> Keith Thurman. Is uh only have an inch. He, he's uh he has sixty nine inches in reach and he's five seven and a half. Now they're like the same size, but I mean let let me know what y'all think. Can Mikey Garcia beat Keith Thurman? Really? Do you think he can beat Keith Thurman? Put that in the comments. I want to know what y'all think about Mikey Garcia versus Keith Thurman. You know, <laughs> in some time near future, maybe two three years. Let's see what that's. See what that's about. Probably even sooner, shit. But then, it's Danny Garcia. I honestly would, would like to see that. Out of all the fighters, that would be probably the most entertaining and, and competitive. Is Garcia against Garcia. Mikey Garcia versus Danny Garcia. That would be very interesting. Danny Garcia's reach is 68 and a half. You know, that's basically the same. It's only a half inch. And uh, he's 5'8" and a half so he got a little bit of height on him that's you know that's that's about it that's about it danny garcia is about um knockover um percentage is 56 percent mike garcia is 83 percent 
I mean, but when you look at the when you look at their uh their their resume, Danny Garcia has a way more better resume than Mikey Garcia. You know, but I think he will get fucked up at one forty seven, y'all. Let me know what y'all think about this shit. Always like and subscribe to the page. Peace.